Ashford.com. Hello and welcome to Ashford.com. You are watching an interesting video on MERS infection, signs you may have its symptoms, travel advisory, transmission, treatment, prevention. Please read the disclaimer carefully. MERS or Middle Eastern Respiratory Syndrome is a disease related to the respiratory functions. It was very first seen in Saudi Arabia during 2012. After finding in Arabia, it has spread over the bordering countries of Arabia. It first displays flu-like symptoms and then causes severe respi respiratory infection in some. The fatality rate is over 30%. The disease occurs because of a coronavirus which is also called the MERS-CoV. Individuals, who have suffered from it, have faced many problems related to breathing. These individuals have also suffered from fever, cough and breathing problems. At first people did not take this problem as a serious one, but, but now 30% of individuals have been died because of the illness. It has traveled into Europe and North America, and it is hoped it can be contained. People were confused about this disease. They thought that it is a normal issue, but very soon they discovered it was not. There are many symptoms of suffering from MERS. For example, a person, who is suffering from fever, cough and breathing issues, may be infected with MERS. This disease can, disease can also cause kidney problems, enlarged and painful genital area, sometimes mistaken for possible prostate problems and the patient can suffer from kidney failure. The disease was discovered in the late days of April. The individual was in the hospital and physicians have released him as being healthy enough to go home. Doctors had done tests and they indicated he was doing fine and ready to leave, but after a week he died. Then doctors had their first case of MERS. This disease is not fatal 70% of the time, and some people never display any symptoms. MERS is really a very serious disease. Because of this disease, more than 700 people have died in 2013. They had the same symptoms and they didn't recognize their health issue. Americans have also come in contact with this disease and were infected by it. This disease has caused many deaths earlier and it is really a dangerous disease. Quarantine is right now the only method of control. If you are coming in close contact with an MERS infected individual, then you can be infected with this disease. 2. By the way CDC says, this disease cannot be spread because of casual contact. Suppose you and a MERS infected individual is traveling in the same bus or train, then you don't need to be, af to be afraid of it. You are safe and you cannot be infected because of riding in same vehicle. However, if the person has not washed his hands and has coughed into them, and you touch something they touched, and then you touch your nose or eyes or mouth, you could possibly become infected. According to research medical experts have found that the virus originally came from camels. But it is still not clear that the virus to humans because of drinking camel milk or because of taking camel meat and food. Yet, now we also know it can be passed from human to human. More cases of MERS have been found in the USA, so the US government is very active in finding more people who may have been infected with it. The purpose of US government is to save their citizens from this harmful illness. Researchers are also looking for a vaccine for the MERS virus, so that people, may be made immune to it. The illness is widely spread in Arab nations and people are taking proper care there to be safe from it. MERS-CoV is a coronavirus, and MERS, Middle Eastern Respiratory Syndrome, exhibits flu-like symptoms and can develop into a severe and sometimes fatal respiratory infection. Thank you for watching this interesting and informative video. This channel offers motivational, inspirational, valuable and informative videos to soothe, cleanse and inspire your health, mind, body and spirit. You can find a lot of interesting videos on wide range of topics here, stay tuned and keep watching.